Well, hello there. My name is Patricia Brower, um, and I am with the Share and Show Your Business Podium and Podcast. This is my first episode, um, so bear with me as I maneuver through all the technicalities of running this this uh, stream. <laughs> the first uh, thing I want to talk about is who am I? Um, my, again, my name's Patricia Brower, and I um, have been a content creator for about five years now, maybe six. Um, I started out, I'll talk about the different projects that I uh, worked on prior to this one, the Share and Show Your Business Podium and Podcast, my new venture. But what I used to, I used to have three or four different ventures that I started. The first one I used to work on, which was a passion for me, was the Ohio Talent Seekers Reality TV Talent Competition. And basically, that was a combination of combining all the reality TV talent competition shows on TV. We basically combined all those and did that here in Ohio for Ohio residents. So we would have you know, people uh, do things like, you know, America's Got Talent do, and So You Think You Can Dance, and American Idol, the comedy relief thing, people, I forgot the name of that one, I'm sorry, uh, and uh, just the list went on. So we would do that with Ohio residents. I'll just uh, show some contestant names, and, and they perform, and we had the voting, and we had the uh, elimination ceremony. So we would do one per quarter. So uh, this guy, he was a magician. I can't say magician <laughs> correctly, but he was a magician. But we would uh, do one per quarter and we would uh, be about 50 people in the competition and we wean them down by the end of the quarter. We had four live performance shows, four live eliminations, did voting online. We did voting in the audience and we get down to the winner. Here's another logo that we have. If you, some of you may have familiar with this, I'm not sure. Then, you know, we had live auditions and this would like these uh, actors that are in the picture. I mean, these people that are in the picture are were actual performers. And so anyway, so we, with the uh, show, we would uh, get down to a, a winner and the winner would win a thousand dollars. This is our season three winner. They would win a thousand dollars the night they win, and then they went win an all expense paid trip to go audition for the reality TV of their choice. So this that particular contestant uh, won a trip to California to go audition for The Voice. She didn't make it, but she came back and won another competition, television competition that was local. So anyway, so that is oh, and then I wanted to show a performance. One of the that particular artist got to uh, perform at uh, the Arnold Schwarzenegger Nager Classic that they hold here in Ohio, and he won the teen competition. So, you know, so many people that performed in our competition got to go on to bigger and better things. And I think, yeah, he he got to audition, he got called to audition for uh, America's Got Talent, but I don't know if he made the list or not. The pandemic happened, so I don't know who got what anymore. So anyway, so basically wanted to show you that about what I do with um, the reality TV talent competition. Moving on to the second venture that I started, and everything closed down when the pandemic happened, you know, for everything. I just did everybody. So I chose not to to keep, you know, going with those. But um, the other uh, venture that had started was Talent Rise, Inc. And it was like instilling the training of the arts inclusive of everyone. So we uh, focus on people with disabilities and then, you know, people that did not have disabilities. And we taught courses. We had instructors teaching courses on the performing side of the arts and then instructors teaching courses on the behind the scenes like theater behind the scenes theater background or music engineering sound you know sound engineering things like that so the next venture that i had is brower entertainment it used to be brower entertainment booking agency for about 20 years maybe 10 years 15 years given my age out there I'm sorry. <laughs> Used to be Brower Entertainment and Booking Agency, but then I um and then at one point for about 4 years I think I trained people all over the world on how to become a booking agent and I also was offered a a college course to teach that 
class. And so, but once I uh, got the curriculum together, started the class, the, the funding got lost for the class. So I didn't pursue that avenue, but it was it was an awesome offer at the time. But now Brower Entertainment is not a booking agency anymore post-pandemic. Now I just do artist promotions. So I promote all type of artists um, through you know, PR, public relations, and, and getting them radio interviews, TV interviews, um, uh, placed in magazines, or, or you know, stuff like that. So to help help them boost their, just boost themselves so they can get seen or, or get seen or, or get uh, better offers and things like that. So if any of uh, that is still up and running, so if anybody's interested in, in promotions, not booking, but promotions, you can, and let me see if I can find myself here, find my banner. You can uh, contact me through BrowerEntertainment.com and see what I offer. The last company that, no, those were the three companies that I want to talk about. Brower Entertainment, Talent Rise Inc., which I didn't show the banners, I'm sorry. Here we go, just real quick so you can see it in case you want to. Well, Talent Rise Inc., I don't have the website up anymore, but you can look on YouTube, Talent Rise Inc., or Facebook, Talent Rise Inc., to, to see the various things that we, you know, promoted throughout the years. But again, these things, and then YouTube, you can look at Ohio Talent Seekers to see the various artists that we work with and, um, you know, and their accomplishments and things like that. So I just wanted to show you that. Again, this will be and so we're trying to talk about what I do now. So let me share and show your business podium and podcast. So what we're, what the hmm, purpose of this channel and podcast is that I will interview entrepreneur, entrepreneurs, small businesses, and artists, various artists, um, whether musicians or singers or, you know, any type of anyone in the arts as well. So I will interview them on this channel. I will, I will interview them on this channel and I will turn it into a podcast as well as the other, when I say share and show your business, the other thing I do now um, is I am a billboard, electronic, outdoor electronic billboard advertiser. And my company, I didn't, I didn't put it down. It's called Pennies on a Dollar Advertising Agency. So what I do is work with small businesses and artists and things like that to help them promote themselves on electronic outdoor billboards throughout the United States. I do have a sample of one of my clients promoting his billboard in Chicago. I'm going to play it a couple times so you can hear it. Um, but yeah, so I, what I'll do is be combining the promotions of this platform, the podcast, plus electronic. We house radio network, billboards all over Chicago, soon all over the country and overseas. You see his billboard up there. And uh, and uh, so that that is a uh, just a sample of, of what I do with this. So um, <clears throat> let's see. So if you are a company or business or a, you know, a small business, an entrepreneur or a entertainer that you want to promote yourselves through my avenues, please, please um, reach out to me on um, my email. Let's see. Well, artists can reach out to me on browerentertainment.com. That's if they want artist promotions. And then I didn't write it down, but for what the, the podcast, you can re reach out to me on this podcast or um, let's see, I have share and show your business at gmail.com. And what else? I have a website, the share and show your business.com website, but I don't have the link uh, put up this time. So that's what I do now. And I talked about the format of this channel. I already talked about it before putting that up there. So I wanted to show that to you. Also wanted to see make see if people will subscribe to my YouTube channel. Share and show your business. Because this is where this one of the main places this uh, podcast will be shown. So what, what I'll be doing over the next week or so is... Uh, uh, stocking up on um, some videos with uh, people I want to introduce and 
they will everybody will be you know put on the YouTube channel and all the other formats and then we'll be building various ways to promote them beyond uh, these three avenues that I mentioned. I think I'm uh, done about talking about what I wanted to talk about this first show.